Hey y'all, I started off with these dang on team bags, but make sure y'all stay tuned to the end of this video so I can show y'all what I put in this and what I'm pricing it at, y'all. I'm going to add this clip in because I said this this video was for these uh team baskets, but I thought it was in there, so make sure y'all stay tuned to see this stuff at the end, honey. Hey everybody, and welcome back to my channel, honey. So listen... Today is Wednesday. Sunday is Easter, y'all. So I'm on crunch time. Y'all know I still had not made no dang on basket. I got three baskets made. But then I got up this morning and, honey, them folks was in my DM. I had like 12 messages unread because I posted a video before I went to bed. And so I had like 12 people in there trying to get baskets. I said, honey, get your boy. I'm going ahead and do these baskets. So I went out, got some stuff. Um, I'll show y'all that stuff in a second. I don't add some more stuff to the, the stuff that I showed y'all the other day in that video. But I wanted to show y'all these weekend bags. Y'all remember we got these bags, honey? Um, Got these bags last year. Uh, Never did use them. And these are the house shoes. I got these after Valentine's Day or after Easter or something last year. I think I paid $5 for those house shoes. And those house shoes come with a little um eye mask that you put over your eye. So I got the house shoe set. I have some bath bomb from Dollar Tree, my soap, my um body cream. And this is actually out of that pack. If y'all seen that Burlington video I did the other day, this little one came out of that pack. I got my perfume that I got from my wholesale perfume person for $3. And this weekend, the bag set comes with a five-piece set, honey. It comes with the pouch, the eye mask, the cozy socks, which are cozy. This the little pouch and the bag itself for a teenage if they're going over to a sleepover, honey. So what I did was, you know, I got my loafer in there. I actually have the long loafer that I put right down the side of the bag. Um... I added some little snacks in here because just because she a teenager, honey, don't mean she don't eat snacks, honey. I got some um, chips ahoy, some gushers, some fruit snacks, some rice crabby treats, some some other little stuff, honey. The fun oh, I ain't tell y'all about these fun deals. They got them at Walmart, too. But I ordered like 42 for $10 or something. I don't remember what it was, but it's on Amazon, y'all. Ordered it out of Amazon. I put it somewhere in my Amazon storefront, but I ordered these. I might put it in the description, y'all. Ordered a big old long pack of those and it was very inexpensive for me to put them fun deals. I think it was like 42 or 72 or something. Very inexpensive. Just to add some little snacks to it. Got some goldfish. I actually got the little books inside of Dollar Tree. You know, they got the journals and stuff like that. And I got a cute little pen to go with because she is a teenager. Got a little slingy that definitely matches the bag. But that's about all I put on here, y'all. You know, I got my body wash and my loafer that definitely takes up space for me. But her being a teenager, I think that journal and even that bunny will work out for her. So let's just say this weekend, the bag, honey, she's going to spend the night at her friend's house. She got everything she needs. She got her perfume in the front, her body mist, her body loafer, her body wash. And she can jot down some stuff, eat some snacks, honey, and call it a day. That's what she's going to have to do. But I really, really like it. Oh, yeah, and the house shoes. And how she was, y'all. This is so cute to me. Now I'm pricing this at sixty-five dollars. Y'all know, but y'all let me know because y'all know these weekend the bags is at Walmart for twenty twenty-five dollars, honey. These bags ain't cheap. Those bags are not cheap, and those house shoes is priced at fifteen to twenty. Anyway, on to my next one. Back here in the back, only thing I changed up, as you can see, I got the body wash and the slingy. Over here, I don't have that. I have the bow bombs and the body wash. I be trying to duplicate my baskets and do them the same way, but honey, I switch up real fast when it's something I don't need. I'm not finna say, hold on, let me go run and get this. No, I'ma use what I got, and that's what I did. I used these bell bombs. You did that go on body wash, honey. Go on wash off and call, call it a day. I got a different book, a different little love journal. Cute little pen to go with it. This pen is really, really cute. Um, same stuff. Same stuff. Only thing I did change up front, I changed the perfume. Oh, and the house shoes are a little different. So, house shoes a little different. And then the body mist and the butterfly perfume. And which, this is so cute, y'all. Got this, once again, $3. The box is even really, really cute. Got this $3 at my wholesale supply. Y'all know who it is. I told y'all I got a video out for it. But that's that's it. Whole nother bag, same concept. Now, this one gonna get crazy. Y'all know I got about 15 of these bags. But what is Lil back there talking about? So, there it is. Leave Leah alone. I'm doing the video, boo. 
I got about 15 of these bags. If not 20, I don't remember how many I got. But I know I got a lot of these bags. But this was my last set of house shoes. I only had two. So I feel like I got to feel, I got some more house shoes. I'm going to try to, I still want to do the house shoes. But I feel like I love that little box. How I got it in the box. I might. Then I go to my, I'm going to go to Dollar Tree, honey. I'm finna put these bags together tonight. I ain't going no dang on Dollar Tree. But I was finna say, you know how Dollar Tree be having them little cute little boxes or something? I can use a box to stuff my um house shoes in. Because um the way this bag is, I really don't got a way to have it stand up. This box helps me be able to lean stuff against it and stuff like that. Too cute. I think this is too cute, y'all. And I'm pricing that $65. Um, I really didn't put much in here. I got all my little snacks. One, two, three, four, five. The bunny, that's six. More snacks, more snacks. Uh, seven, eight, nine. Nine items beside the perfume, the house shoes, and the bag. And the snacks. Nine items, okay? Definitely costed me under $25 to make this bag. But even at $25, I feel like it need to be about $75. I'm counting in between $65 and $75. I'm trying to keep it kind of inexpensive for the parents that don't want to spend that much money for these kids for Easter, honey. Especially this teenager. But it being a teenage basket, I feel like $75 fits it. But I might just go ahead with $65. I really, really might. I think I got these for a dollar. Or $5. I know I got those for $5. That was 3 I definitely put under $20 in this bag. You know, anytime I'm using these snacks. Mainly these are priced at about $0.26. Cent. So, in snacks alone, I probably spent $3. If that much, okay? So, I definitely spent less than $20. I felt like $65 we good. That's $45. And like I said, if that's $45 profit. And if I got 10 of them, that's $450. So, I don't know, y'all. What y'all think about this bag? What would y'all make it, honey? It is Easter. Trying to give my parents a little inexpensive option. One of these are going for a lady that already ordered a $75 Spider-Man. I might make these $75, y'all. Because now that I think of it, she's going to $75 Spider-Man. And this got way, way more stuff in there than that. So, I think I'm going to keep these teenage, teenage bags at $75. But, guess what? My little slow self don't did, honey. I don't ran out of that dang old big bags that I do my, um, my chairs and my um, other stuff with. So, I don't order me some more. They'll be here Friday, uh, Easter, Sunday. I'm going out Thursday. No, that's tomorrow. I'm going out Friday and Saturday, Okay. You ain't going to catch me out there on Easter, but I might go out there early, early Easter until about 1. I don't know, because I got a cake on Sunday, too. So, I don't know, y'all. I think I'm going to go out until about 1 o'clock on Easter, because I got to come back and do that cake at 2. That's what I think I'm going to do, because other than that, I sat there all, at least until Leo had her little Easter egg hunt. She want to do Easter egg hunt, honey. Um, so, yeah, that's what I'm doing, y'all. I'm going to wrap these up, because I don't ran out the bag. I'm about to use some Thule, and I will come back and show y'all. Oh, Leah, your hands smell good, baby. <laughs> Alright, I'll come back and show y'all how it is wrapped up. I gotta improvise, honey. I gotta use what I got. What you huh? Hey, YouTube! <laughs> look at Liz. Hey, YouTube! Hey, YouTube! Come on, when you get out YouTube, go look at your phone. Go look at the group chat. Let me get out YouTube. Okay, y'all. So, I don't use the Tully to... And I got it on my thing, too. I got it on my Amazon storefront. If I, I make sure, okay. Um, I'm using a tool to wrap these bags because I don't ran out of the big size bags. Look at Leah. <laughs> um, Leah, let me spin it around so they can see how I look with the tool. And that's T U L L E, y'all. Y'all know I be saying stuff wrong, honey. That's the little bow I I showed y'all that ribbon the other day, but that's the little ribbon I have, and that's how I look in that tool. Leah, they can't see it if you're spinning it like that, Mom. <laughs> I was trying to help them see it. She said, I was trying to help them see it. Okay, Lil. So that is Mom, it. I love that little. Mm -mm. I love how that halo, um, that you see it. Y'all see it. Florence and glow, whatever it's called. Honey. I got nothing to sit on. I can't sit on the ice. She said, I ain't got nothing to sit on. Look, y'all, I got the chill, the stuff in the chill. Lil, I ain't got nothing to sit on. But anyway, I'm going to go ahead and finish up this video. No, Leo. Wait a minute. Let me finish the video, y'all. I'm sorry. Leo won't let me get through the video. All right, y'all. You want me to rip the phone? <laughs> Trying to get myself together. Nom, 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 All right, y'all. So, this is it Look, wrapped in the tool. I think it look good. I used the little tool. I got a big roll over here. Leo, pass me that right there. What, what I wrapped the basket with so I can show them how it look. No, right here. This. Yep, that. Pass that to me so I can show them how it looks. It comes in a big roll, y'all. Look at my helper. 
it comes in a long roll like this and it's actually folded in half it's real big so i laid it out just pulled it over one side pulled it over the front pulled it over the back squeezed it tight around and then that was it wait Lil. and that was it y'all so that is it for this video i just want to show y'all how it looks with the tool on it because like i said i don't got no shrink wrap bag but it look good to me let me know what y'all think 75 65 what y'all think honey and you can see through the tool i think it's cute um, with the shrink wrap, it would have started squeezing my bag and all that stuff. I think for this particular thing, I think this doing me justice, honey. I might have to do my dang on shells like that if my bags don't come in on time. But they said they're going to be here Friday, but I really want to do something tonight. I don't know. Um, but that is it, y'all. That's it for this video. This is the other one wrapped up in a tool with that little bow from Dollar Tree, honey. The little ribbon I got from Dollar Tree. I showed y'all in my other video. But that is it. What y'all think about this toolie though? This tool, whatever it is. What y'all think about this? Y'all think I need to shrink wrap this thing or do it look good like this? Can y'all see? Is it this the camera giving it justice? What y'all think? That's the back of it. What y'all think? Let me know what y'all think down in the comments. I hope y'all like this video. I had to bring y'all something, honey, to let y'all see what I got going on. But that's just two of them. I still got a lot more than up go. Right now, like I said, Easter is Sunday. Today is Wednesday. And it is about 8 o'clock at night, y'all. 8 o'clock. I'm probably going to put it all night. I'm having an Easter aunt at school. <laughs> Listen, me, y'all. I'm having an Easter egg hunt. She having an Easter egg hunt tomorrow at school, y'all. She and I already picked her basket out. And she got to get ready to go to bed. But I just had to come in here and show y'all how it's wrapped with the tool. Let me know what you think. And I will see y'all in the next video. Oh, and FYI. My everything that's in here, I knew I was going to have to use this tool. So I used some of this duct tape, also linked in the description, and taped. I taped everything down. Nothing is going to be moving away. Because, you know, normally with that shrink wrap, it holds everything, pushes everything, and holds it together. All right now it's giving is tape. That's all it's giving. I have picked it up, moved it, and everything, and nothing is wiggling and my wobbling. So make sure you tape this stuff down if you're doing something like this. But all right, y'all. See y'all in the next one. Bye. Y'all know I had to pop back in here and show y'all these dang on Disney Princess bags that I'm doing for $50, y'all. So, y'all know we got the little gift bags. You get these gift bags from Dollar Tree, okay? I brought these dolls last year for $3 when um, Walgreens had they sale. But right now, at Walmart, they are $8.97. So, I have brought some... um. What did I buy today? I bought some Frozen Doors, the Anna, the Elsa doll. I bought some Spider-Mans. The Spider-Mans were $9.99. I bought some Batmans. They was $10. I feel like putting a $10 doll in because I'm using those that I bought for $10. i am using those for $75. I'm putting those in a bag, a box, a big box. But these bags are um, $50. And I did the inexpensive doors that I bought. But if this parent had to go out and buy this doll, she's going to spend about $12 to $15. So paying $50 for the bag is not that it's not bad. Um, all I kind of put in there, I wish I would have got some more of those Dollar Tree snacks because I feel like I ain't got enough treats in here. I pulled a little handful of candy. I got some Oreos, some Doritos. I know over here I got some goldfish, some Rice Krispie treats, a little Oreo, different fruit snacks. I have, um, oh, I got some milk fruit snacks. Where they at? These children be trying to get me, y'all. They sure be trying to get me. I got to put some milk fruit snacks in here. But, um... The main thing that I use to fill up my space are these big old cups that you can get from Party City. Party City has them. Walmart has them. Fill that up with candy. Right here is just a little couple, a lot of little snacks. They had these crayons at Dollar Tree. They came in a three pack like this. And I just took one out the pack, put it in there. Um, but mainly hardly, you know. The doll is my prized possession in this dang on bag, y'all, because that's kind of all I really got besides a lot of treats. I got a little fashion set in the back they can play with, a puzzle thing they can play with, but they really going to love that doll. They really, really going to love that doll. I got a playing pack and go set. These were actually a uh, dollar at Party City, but Walmart has some smaller ones where you get like five or eight in a pack for like five dollars, eight in a pack, I think. Walmart has them. Different characters. They had uh, Coca Milly, Walmart. Um, they had, I'm going to say Walmart. They had Coca Millie. They had, um, 
Minnie Mouse. It came with like eight in the pack, and it had these princes for about five dollars. So I'm using those too. They're a lot smaller than that big one from uh, Part of the City, though. And then just the snacks, y'all. The gushers. These little poppet things. I got these from um Amazon. They came real fast too. It was a lot of them came in the box from Amazon, real inexpensive. See, I see my gushers right here, and I'm gonna eat milk up, honey. I need me some of the dang on snacks on, y'all. But where's my dang on box? Oh, there they go. Here they go, y'all. I'm up here finna cue somebody or taking my dang on snacks. Let me dang on right here. I need to cut my mess out. I got a lot of stuff going on, y'all. A lot of stuff going on. Anyway, you gotta give me some snacks, honey. I need it for myself. But I just had to chop in here and show y'all that. That's all I'm doing. I feel like this basket definitely need more. Because she ain't even really got nothing she can lean on. She leaning all kind of ways. Another thing I had to use was a lot of packaging paper down in here. I had a box. I put a box that I had over in here to help make up most of that space. And the rest of it was just a lot of packaging paper. So she real unstable, honey. She doing her little ballerina thing and keep falling back. I don't really like that. I feel like I need something else behind it to make it stand up like that. So I'm going to put one more thing back there. Let's see what I can put. I know these little fruit snacks ain't going to help, but I'm going to just stick it back there. Ain't it? Oh, yep, they did help, y'all. Little fruit snack did a little justice. But once I shrink wrap this, it's going to be all right. And the way I have to shrink wrap this is I'm going to have to... um actually pull the bag upside down to come down on it like a dome bag that's what i'm gonna have to do because my bag is not tall enough okay um y'all know me i'm improvised i think this look really really cute what y'all think about this for 50 dollars? the reason it's 50 because it had a doll in it i feel like it's not much in there she got a lot of snacks and she only has about one two three four five things she can play with besides that doll and a lot of little sh snacks and stuff yeah, let me know what y'all think about this. But this time, y'all cousin is gone, honey. I'm out this video. I will see y'all in the next one. I just had to jump in here and show y'all this stuff. Bye, y'all. Success is a finicky thing. And if you ain't sure, no, it'll never be.